Hi, I'm Dr. Ted Rogers. This is History by the Plate. Have you ever wondered how in the world did we ever get butter? I mean, how logical is it that someone really said, hey, I got this white liquid from the underbelly of that cow over there. It's really bland, but I bet that if I beat the ever-loving crap out of it, it will turn into a savory, flavorful solid. Nah, that's not really very logical. So, how in the world did it happen? Let's go take a look. The origins of butter go back to the Neolithic period, around 10,000 BC. Hunter-gatherers begin to be replaced by agricultural villages. As the people of northern Mesopotamia, what we now know as Iraq, began to cultivate wheat and barley. Shortly after that, the domestication of the yak, the sheep and the goat began. Now, since this period was pre-pottery Neolithic, there were no jars or pots with which people could transport liquids. Instead, they used animal skin bags. Anthropologists give educated speculation to the origin of butter coming when a northern Mesopotamian farmer needed to transport goat or sheep milk over a fair distance. As the milk sloshed about in the skin, the milk solids formed together, resulting in butter. This accidental discovery led to the more purposeful making of butter, when skin bags of milk were tied into tree branches or on a tripod, which villagers then vigorously shook until the milk solids separated from the liquid. Today, in some remote villages in Africa, this is how some people still make butter. The first written records of how to make butter were carved on a limestone tablet from the year 4500 BC. The Bible says that Abraham and Sarah entertained angels with a feast of milk, meat, and butter around 1800 BC. As well, Hindus have been making offerings of butter to Lord Krishna for over 3000 years, a practice that continues today. Still, Butter was slow to take root in Europe, which is what we'll look at next week. I hope that this has been fun and informative. I'll be publishing how to make the best tasting butter at home this coming Friday on our website, www.historybytheplate.com. Check it out. You'll also find plenty of other fun recipes, fun histories, as well as some great travel tips. Oh, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. It's fun and free. Happy cooking!